We've gotten to our, um, our like dogfight-esque position. Let's hit some reversals. So. So, again, two angles. From here, I score my underhook. I come high and low. The first thing I'm gonna do is our knee tap. So from here, I'm gonna reach through, bring his knees to my chest, and I'm gonna drive through my palm. From here, I've got two passes. I keep my deep underhook, I connect my head to my partner's chest, and I block this knee as I move around. So he tries to bring his knees to his chest now, which is regard, he can't, and I sit through into my position. Our other option. No. Oh. From here, off this underhook, I need to, I give myself a nice back step here. So I back step around this, this, this uh, top leg, and then I'm gonna just re-scoot this bad boy for now. Again, we get into this situation where what is happening, I have back exposure, and he's facing away from me, so I now I can go back to my side control position to start working on my partner. So I'll give you two angles, to uh, not another angle on this, on both. Here, under hook, up to the top, I knee tap. I keep the frame and I move around. He tries to bring his knees back, he can't. There's my frame. Again, I want to break this down in terms of my lat being engaged. I'm not framing like this. My lat is engaged to my body here. So he really kicks those knees through. He can't. There's my first pass in reversal. Our second one. From here, under hook, up, head connected, pinky connected, lats connected. I tap the knee. From here, I clear this top leg by back stepping around and then re scooping so he can't bring his knees uh, back between me and him. Okay. 